On Wednesday, Lizzo showed off her well-known figure in a laid-back outfit in Los Angeles. The 36-year-old Grammy winner, who just experienced the death of her dog Puka, was seen landing at LAX following a sun-filled trip to Turks and Caicos, a popular destination for celebrities. The Truth Hurts hitmaker, wearing a stylish black graphic t-shirt, showed off her toned body and a hint of her belly. Matching leggings completed the ensemble, and she wore a head wrap and dark designer shades to keep a low profile. Following her recent health journey, the pioneer of body positivity now embraces body neutrality, as evidenced by Lizzo's appearance. The concept of body positivity has evolved from the outdated popular perception, she stated in March. The state has changed to body neutrality. Through her lyrics, she has glorified her body, and on Instagram, she has posted affirmations addressed to her stomach. She acknowledged, though, to the New York Times that it's not always possible to love oneself. She vowed not to lie and claim that she loved her body every single day. The truth is that your perception of your body is always shifting. I don't always feel good about my body, there are days when I love it. Lizzo revealed that she has changed her focus to upholding a balanced diet and consistent exercise since finishing her special tour. She remarked, I'm taking the time every day to put some love into my body. I never regret going for a walk or working out at Pilates. I've been losing weight very slowly, methodically, she continued. Lizzo has indicated that she is back in the studio working on new songs, even if she hasn't formally confirmed the release of a new studio album. Lizzo was deep into the songwriting process when she posted a video of herself in January, singing into a muffled microphone. The artist hasn't released any new music since releasing special in July 2022, which included the hits, About Damn Time, and To Be Loved, Am I Ready. Lizzo won her first major category in February 2023 when she won the coveted Record of the Year Award at the 65th Annual Grammy Awards with her song, About Damn Time.